Hey everybody, welcome back to another edition of Dave's Diner. Today we're going to be doing uh, gourmet mac and cheese. Uh, it's going to have some ham in it, some mushrooms, and some spinach, and uh, we'll show you how that all comes together. So stick with me, and thank you for joining me at Dave's Diner. Okay, this is uh, the ingredients that go into this gourmet mac and cheese dish. Over here we have uh, some mushrooms that have been sauteed in a little bit of butter. So that's what they look like. We have some already cooked uh, ham that's been chopped. We have some uh, frozen spinach that's been drained and, and uh, chopped up a little bit better. We have uh, the macaroni, which is some shells, and then we have some fontina cheese. And I like fontina cheese because it has a really kind of a robust flavor uh, to the dish. And then it's all gonna wind up in here and baked at uh, about 400 degrees for oh about uh, half hour 45 minutes now what we're making here folks is a uh, what they call a roux it's a french word and uh, it's equal parts flour and butter and uh, melt those together and it makes a kind of a paste like this you want to cook it long enough to cook out the uh, taste of the flour so you wind up with something like this then as soon as you get it cooked down <clears throat> you want to add some cream and this is going to be the base for your cheese sauce for the mac and cheese now what we have with all the cream is this sauce it's called a bechamel sauce and this is a base sauce you can do pretty much anything with this make a cheese sauce you could do a gravy out of it um, just about anything but what we're going to do here is add the cheese to it the fontina cheese that i was talking to you about and uh, we're going to create this cheese dish So now that we have this uh, really nice cheese dish, or cheese uh, sauce I should say, um, now we're going to add all these things, the ham, spinach, and the mushrooms, all in there, and we're going to mix that around so everything gets all combined. Then we're going to add the uh, macaroni. Okay, so it's in the baking dish and uh, it's ready to go in the uh, 400 degree oven. Okay, folks, well, that's the mac and cheese right there. That's what it looks like. So I hope you enjoyed the process and uh, Hope you try it. Thank you. Well, how'd you like that? It came out pretty good, didn't it? So mac and cheese will never be the same again. If you do mac and cheese, you're going to want to try this recipe. So again, thanks for joining me at Dave's Diner. We'll see you next time.